Hello everyone, Flashcode here. A lot of people have been asking for this tutorial ever since I released my spacious drilling animation. And now finally, here's part 1. This house is bigger and more complex than the previous two houses, so I've split this tutorial up into multiple parts. I'm releasing the parts as I make them, and the next parts should be out soon. These pictures show what the house will be when it's finished. And this picture shows where we will get up to at the end of part 1. If you are building this house in survival mode, you will need these resources. Depending on your building environment, you might also require up to 90 smooth stone blocks. If you are building along with this tutorial, you may want to pause the video whenever I display this pause symbol, in order to complete the step before the video gets too far ahead. Ok, let's get started. This structure will take up a space of 30 blocks long and 17 blocks wide. We will begin by choosing an area in around the middle of your building area to make the basement. Select a rectangle, 10 blocks by 7 blocks and dig down 5 layers. The next layer down is the floor of our basement, so don't dig that up. We want it to be smooth stone, so if it's not completely smooth stone, fix that now. Now we'll make those alcoves that contain chests. On one side of one of the long sides, cut out a 6 block space, 2 blocks wide and 3 high. Make two more of these, leaving 2 block spaces between them like this. Then turn around and do the same on the other side. Now for the stairway. Starting on the left side of one of the short sides, dig a path 4 blocks long and 2 blocks wide. Then cut another 4 blocks along, but leave an extra row of blocks on the bottom with each new layer. If you have uncovered any more blocks which are not smooth stone, you should replace them now. Ok, now I'll start making the walls into stone bricks. On each side of this room, take away the first three layers of ground blocks and replace them with stone bricks. Do the same for this stairway as well. And now for the ceiling, so replace the two blocks above each alcove with spruce planks. And now at the same height as those blocks, cover the whole basement with more planks. Extend that ceiling two spaces along the stairway. You see this row of dirt blocks here? Remove them, and for the first block on the left, replace it with another spruce plank but for the rest, replace them with stone bricks. Do the same on the other side as well. Now for the next step, we can finally put the stairs in. Place 8 spruce stairs on the 4 bottom layers, but leave the top layer empty for now. That's all we'll do on the basement in this part of the tutorial. We'll finish it in a later part. Now we'll get started on the first floor. The next few blocks are a bit random, so just follow what you see in the video. Take out that grass block and replace it with a spruce plank. Place a stone brick there, and another one there. Turn around and place another stone brick there, leaving a one block gap from the left side. Then turn back around and add those two stone bricks, and then connect them with the other block to make a wall. Take away these grass blocks and replace them with planks. Then continue to place those three more rows of planks as shown in the video. For the next bit of the tutorial, you can just follow what's shown in the video. You'll just be placing stone bricks for the walls, and those white spaces show the doorways so leave them empty.
by doing the flowers now, so I replaced the grass with the spruce planks as shown in the video. Don't replace all of it just yet. Good. Now take away that last piece of grass, but don't replace it just yet. You'll find a row of grass underneath the stone brick wall. Replace it with more stone bricks. See these two white spaces? To make the staircase more tidy, we're going to place two upside down spruce stairs there. Next is to place some stone bricks in those highlighted spaces. Place another stone brick right there as well. This time we're doing the same thing with those other upside down stairs, but these ones are made out of stone bricks. Place another two stone bricks on those stairs you just placed. Now we can finally finish up the floor. Place the last two pieces of the staircase. Fill that area in with planks. These highlighted spaces show where we want to put some more stairs. You can fill in this area with planks now too. For those grass blocks that you can see the sides of, which are underneath stone bricks, replace them with more stone bricks. Finish the floor by replacing the remaining dirt with planks. Finish the steps by placing two more step pieces right there. Now for the last step of part one, replace the two grass blocks underneath the entrance doorway with stone bricks. And that is it for part one of the spacious drilling tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it and found it useful. Part 2 should be out soon after this first video. See you next time.